Here's a GRE probability question. Let's take a look. A bookie who takes bets on Little League games calculates the probabilities of victory for the Largoville Lions in their next three games. So against the Hartsville Herons, they have a 92% chance of winning. Against the Amityville Amoebas, they have a 13% chance of winning. And against Untitled Team Sponsored by Jeff Sandwich Shop, they have a 51% chance of winning. Here's the question. According to this model, what is the probability that the Lions will win at least one game? All right, so what we could do here is calculate the probability of every individual different scenario. So maybe we win the first one, we lose and lose. That would be a one victory. We lose the first one, we win, lose, that's one victory, and then lose, lose, win. But that's not enough, right? Because we're asking about at least one game. So then we would have to calculate the probabilities of winning two games and in all the different uh, ways that we could do that, and then winning all three of the games and adding those together. That's a lot of busy work. It, you, you could do it that way, but it would be a lot of busy work. A much simpler way to approach this is to ask, well, under what scenario do they not win at least one game? There's only one case where they don't win at least one game, and that's where they lose all of their games. So what's the probability that they lose all of their games? We can calculate that. That's going to be, we could even create another column here. The probability that they lose this one is going to be 8%. We're going to assume that you can only win or lose a game. There's no ties, right? The probability that you lose this one is 87%. And the probability that you lose this one is 49%, right? All of these need to add up to 100. So what's the probability that I'm going to lose all three of these games in a row? Well, it's going to be 0 0.08 times 0.78 times 0.49. And when I do that on my handy dandy calculator, I get, I believe it's, all right, down here, 0 0.0341, so about 3%. The probability that they lose every single game here is 3%. Well, what's the probability that they win at least one game? In other words, that they don't lose all of their games. It's just gonna be one or 100% minus this. So if I do 1 minus 0 0.034, I get 0 0.096, I think it's 965 or so. It rounds up to 97. So the probability that they win at least one game is going to be 97%. For more GRE tips and tricks or to sign up for my online course, follow the link on my profile.